two people in the capital, Kyiv, and one person in the city of Mykolaiv. The attacks targeted several other cities as well. The Ukrainian army says its air defenses shot down 29 missiles and 15 drones. Parts of the city have been affected by power cuts. And the attack comes as EU diplomacy chief Joseph Borrell is visiting the capital. So we can get the very latest from our correspondent Nick Connolly in Kyiv. Uh, Nick, what more can you tell us about this attack on Kyiv? It was a very loud morning here in Kyiv, especially in the centre. You could hear the interceptor missiles at about seven local time, um, even if you hadn't gone down to the um, to the kind of air bunkers or down to your cellar or even into your bathroom, as is the advice here, you could definitely feel that danger. It did then pass after a couple of hours, but certainly we're seeing that Russia is having to build up stocks of missiles to do very complicated attacks because Ukraine's air defenses are now so solid and so effective that otherwise basically everything got shut down. We've heard from the Ukrainian militaries, they say about two thirds of targets were intercepted, but as you mentioned, it was still enough to cause considerable damage. We're now hearing about four casualties in Kiev and dozens of wounded. Uh, parts of the city were without power and heating for quite some time. So that is a very kind of stark reminder, especially to Joseph Borrell visiting Kiev here, that uh, 